Good afternoon, Tim Hatfield with you from the Southern Cross News Desk. A pair of Wollongong men has managed to avoid jail after pleading guilty to assaulting another man in July. Ricky and Shane Davis changed their plea at their hearing. The court heard the victim had been walking by, walking by their home, approaching them before an argument broke out, with the victim then picking up a brick to threaten the pair before throwing it at them. Both brothers then began punching the man, knocking him to the ground, then kicking him. Both were given good behaviour bonds. Shell Harbour Council has been forced to crack down on people illegally using the Albion Park Rail Cemetery. It comes amid reports people had been setting up outdoor furniture in the graveyard and using it as a dog park. Council says inspectors also found people had been leaving garden waste along the boundaries. Shell Harbour Councillor Kelly Marsh says the site needs to, be, needs to remain one of respect and reflection. And to sports news now, and Larry Davidson is said to return to the Hawks this weekend with the hopes he could turn things around. The guys meet the Sydney Kings this round. To the weather now and on the satellite map that ridge is still in place across much of New South Wales though a cold front is said to push through as it starts to weaken. With that we'll see some cloud and wet conditions progressing over the next couple of days. A warm and sunny day for Canberra today. 33 degrees is the top. A bit of cloud over Sydney in 26 degrees. Fine in Brisbane. Warm and wet in Adelaide. A hot day for Dubbo today, 37 degrees is the top orange, getting to 30 with 39 degrees in Wagga. Sunshine also for Goulburn today, 33 degrees is the top, 26 in Wollongong today. Bega getting to 31 with a few spots of showers about the place. And checking ahead for the next couple of days in Wollongong, cloud forming tomorrow, 27 degrees is the top, then wet on Thursday and 23, fine by Friday down to 21.